the mindfulness practice has been used in the last decades, de- decades to help patients to manage chronic pain condition and migraine too. There are several reports in the recent literature that demonstrate that mindfulness practice can be very helpful for patients to be more conscious about their clinical condition, to use at the best the medication that we give them. So we started this kind of project with 170 patients with chronic migraine and medication overuse, and we randomized these patients after a withdrawal. On one side, we treated patients just with the traditional pharmacological compounds, because at that time, in 2018, we didn't have maps. On the other side, we treated patients with pharmacological treatment added by mindfulness. And what we found after one year of follow-up is that patients who have been treated with pharmacological treatment and mindfulness are going much better because they can manage their pain more adequately. They look by using the practice. So in our opinion, this is an important, an important because uh, we can give patients some tools to manage the, the, the pain. And in this way, even if we have fantastic molecules that are new for the treatment of uh, migraine, we can improve much more the efficacy of these molecules. And at the same time, to give patients instruments for being uh, more responsible and more conscious about uh, their clinical condition. And this uh, can be important because uh, there are some implications for social cost, uh, sanitary cost, uh, health system cost. Uh, so, in direct costs and indirect costs uh, that are connected to the migrant, chronic migrant condition. So, we will see the last results of this project and we hope to have good data to publish in the future.